looks like it's workout time. Hi, Coach my name is Hulk here. So I so hope you're ready. <laughs> here we go. So we're gonna start from the floor. We're gonna start with push-ups. So we have four moves back to back. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna keep rotating in a circuit to get as many rounds as you possibly can. Ideally three to five rounds, depending on how you feel and on your fitness level. So here we go. Come on down to the floor now. So your first exercise is push-ups. So wide arms, so your hands wider than your shoulders. So you're gonna drop your chest to your elbow height and you're gonna come up. Option here is to drop the knees down. So what you wanna achieve is chest to elbow height, elbows out to the side in 45 degrees and up, all right? Now you're gonna do 20 reps of those. If 20 is too much, just do 10, it's okay. You're gonna come up after that and we're gonna do squats. So squats, feet, ju feet just outside the hips, toes facing forward, we're not doing that. Toes here, so you're gonna push your hips and you're gonna sit into squats. So let me show you from the side view here. Feet just outside the hips, sitting back. The hips go back just above your knee height. You wanna keep a curve in your lower back as much as you can and your knees stay aligned with your toes. So you're gonna do 30 of those. If 30 is too much, you can always do less, which is 15 reps. Now, if you want a little bit more, you can do squat jumps. Now, I wouldn't suggest plyometrics before I've thought, but if you are somebody that trains regularly and you can do this and you're used to more intense exercise, don't go with your highest intensity, go with an average intensity or take it down a notch just before I've thought, okay? Now, move number three is going to be tricep push-ups. So you're gonna come on down to the floor. You're gonna keep the hands under your shoulders and you're gonna twist your elbows in, please. So option one, you can do on the toes right here. Keep the, toe, the knees right here, then push the toes down. Push up, up, chest again to your elbow height and bring your elbows to the back right here, okay? Try not to flare your elbows out because that's gonna hurt your shoulders. Option two is to do it on the toes if you'd like. So right here, keep your hips aligned with your shoulders. Down and up, down and up, all right? You're gonna do 20 reps of those. Again, if 20 is too much, just do 10, perfectly fine. Now, last is a plank. So for the plank, you're gonna keep your hands under your shoulders, feet hip width. You're just gonna hold it here, eyes to the floor, tuck the chin in and squeeze your belly. Now the option for this is to drop the knees down. Now we're not going back, we're not going forward and we're not dropping our hips. Let's not do that please, okay? So make sure you're here, hips, Align with your shoulders, eyes to the floor, and hold it for 30 seconds to one minute, okay? Depending on where you're at. Even if you stop at 30 seconds, perfectly fine. But your position is really important here. Try not to dip and try not to be here or here. Because that's mainly working your shoulders, not your core. This is the correct position for your plank. So, push-ups, squats, tricep push-ups, planks, okay? Next up, one last move, which is lunges. So you're gonna keep your feet under the hips. I'll start from this position, actually. Feet under the hips, step back, bend, and come back up. Now, I would suggest that you take one, uh, you alternate the legs. So you take it one big step back here. However, if you're struggling to find your balance, keep the feet here, big step back, find your balance in your front foot, bend, up, change. Step, bend, up, change. The most important thing in the lunge is dropping your back knee towards the floor. It doesn't have to touch the floor, but you wanna bend as much as you can here. And you wanna make sure you're pushing through your heel. You have a nice bend here and you're on your toes. So the heel is off the floor and your chest is up and your core is tight. Now, if you want more, you can add a jump if you want to. Optional. You can step or jump. You're gonna do 30 of those. So it's technically 15 on each leg, okay? So that's it, that's your circuit. Push-ups, uh, what did we do? Oh, push-ups, squats, tricep push-ups, plank for 30 seconds to one minute, and then lunges in the end. You're gonna do three to five rounds, as many as you can, and then just relax and recover after that. Cool, enjoy your workout, guys. See you soon.